Good day fellow farmers, I am Vincent, the face behind Cornerstone Acres. This channel is dedicated to empowering farmers with knowledge on crops and uh, livestock. Whether you are a seasoned pro or just starting, join me on this educational journey as we navigate the landscape of agriculture. Today we are addressing a topic that many farmers or farm owners may find challenging. How to navigate the process of uh, terminating or firing a farm employee? In this situation where there is no HR department in place, we'll be breaking down this complex task into simple steps. So whether you are a seasoned, a seasoned uh, farmer or just uh, starting out, stay tuned for practical insights on handling employment issues on the farm. So in this video, let's dive in and uh, start with the first important thing. Documentation. Start by, uh, if you are about to fire your employee, the most important thing to have is documentation. Start by documenting the reasons for termination. This includes any performance issues, if there are any violation of farm policies or other relevant incidents. Having a clear documentation will help you explain the decision if questioned later. Another point is uh, how to handle when you are firing your employees. Choose a suitable time. On this one, find a quiet and private time to discuss the matter with the employee. This helps maintain the dignity and reduces the chances of embarrassment or confrontation. Another step is uh, prepare for the conversation. Before meeting with the employee, outline key points you want to communicate. Be concise and focus on specific examples or incidents that led to the decision that uh, you are about to take, that is firing that employee. So it's important to stay calm and professional during the conversation. The next step that you should take is uh, always try to have a witness. That is, if, it's, uh, if uh, one is available. If possible, have a neutral third party present during the termination meeting. This witness can help collaborate the facts and ensure that the process is fair and transparent. The next step is uh, contact. Conduct the meeting. Start the meeting by expressing gratitude for the employee's uh, contribution. For that time you've worked or his farm you've worked uh, at your farm then clearly and respectively communicate the reason for the termination on this one ensure that you use simple and straightforward language avoid any technical jargon next step allow the employee to respond Give the employee an opportunity to share their perspective. Listen actively and empathetically. But on this one, on this one, remain firm in your decision. Be open to constructive feedback, but make it clear that the decision has been finalized. Next step now. Provide information on final payments. Explain to the employee that you are firing the process of for finalizing payments, including any old wages, vacation days, or uh, any benefits that uh, he or she is, uh, might be entitled. So ensure that the employees understand the timeline for receiving their final paycheck. Next step, retrieve company property. If the employee has any company property such as tools or equipment, outline the process for returning these items. This ensures a smooth transition and prevents potential conflicts. Next step is uh, communicate the next step that will take place. Clearly outline the next step for both parties. This may include uh, details about returning personal belongings, the timeline for the final paycheck and any other relevant information. Last but not least, 
always maintain professionalism. Throughout the process, maintain a professional and respectful tone. Avoid uh, personal attacks or negative comments. This help preserves the reputation of the firm and minimizes the risk of legal repercussions. Thank you, fellow farmers. Thank you for joining us today on Cornerstone Acres as we tackle this sensitive topic of letting go of farm employee. Remember, communication is key and handling the, this situation with empathy and clarity can make the process smooth for everyone involved. So if you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up subscribe for more practical farming tips and hit uh, that notification bell so that you never miss out on valuable insights feel free to share your thoughts and experiences in the comment section below so until next time happy farming and take care bye bye